we we could end oh, our vacation early. This yeah. build like does not have the proper. Oh, there's our dog. Um, let's just like play with our dog. Let's be sweet. Let's give our dog a treat. You know, this dog also deserves a treat. We're having a treat. I'm having a treat. My treat is the Dr. Pepper. <clears throat> make the Great twins good. the same gender. I did make the twins the same gender last episode. So if you don't know what they are, we'll find out later. It's my last week. Oh, I missed that one. Sorry. Do you clean my house? Yes. That deserves a Dr. Pepper. 100%. Mm -mm 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 -mm. is going to go get a Dr. Pepper. <laughs> It's my first time here and I love the vibes of the chat. Welcome, awkwardly strange butterfly. I'm so glad that you like our vibes. Oh, wow. Okay. That doesn't sound very good, but he is trying. I would love to say that he doesn't deserve a Dr. Pepper for this performance, but everyone deserves a Dr. Pepper. <laughs> so, oh no. My fair lady. <laughs> I don't actually remember the lyrics of the song. I finally got my new car yesterday. My last one is 20 years old. Oh my gosh. You must be enjoying that new car. New car smell. Perfect. In a bicycle built for two. Are you kidding me? That's level three guitar. Even the dog is sad listening to that. That's okay. <laughs> He's so proud of himself. He's like, I love playing my guitar. Oh my gosh. Mm -hmm. Oh, and Lloyd. This gen is themed after the parent trap, which is why we currently find ourselves in a boat for their honeymoon. Um, Simone's going to be having two twin babies, but we do need to figure out a reason why they get divorced. So why are they going to get divorced, team? Let me know. Here's more of like a... You know, like a little European boy. He grew up in uh, Tartosa, and she's more of a city girl. I feel like that could be a reason. Oh my gosh, he's sleeping outside? Okay, he's sleeping outside on the boat. Versus, oh, someone's calling Neve. That's his mom, by the way. That was our first gen. Our first gen was Mama Mia. Who loves? Who doesn't love Mama Mia? I'm telling you right now. Oh my gosh, I've had a job interviews all week for prestigious law firms. Congratulations! That deserves a Dr. Pepper. I sent out invites to my reception that I am finally getting to throw almost a year after my wedding. Oh, that definitely deserves a Dr. Pepper. Denial. Ooh, congratulations. <laughs> I'm realizing this is kind of like blocking some information of The Sims. So let's pop this like up here. Yeah, let's pop it up here. You know what? We don't, I'll read you guys all the notifications if we have any. And then we'll put, we'll put this right below. There oh, you go. Oh. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, I like it. I like it, Picasso. Mm, getting my second college degree in May. That is so exciting, congratulations. So many like collegiate, so many smart, intelligent students <sighs> in my in my chat today. We love to see it. She wants to be an interior designer in the city and he wants to live in Henford on Bagley, okay. I still need to watch Mamma Mia. You definitely need to watch Mamma Mia. Okay, they're gonna break up because she wants to go to the city. She doesn't like his guitar playing. That's a good reason for divorce. The guitar. <laughs> She's like, mm-mm. I just saw that I got a response from a job I applied for. Congratulations. That deserves a Dr. Pepper. She tried this little life thinking she could make it work, but she can't. Mm, okay. Did the mom get back together with his dad? Yes. Oh, look at his little dancey moves. That'd be grief because Neve dies. Oh, um, that's a good idea. I was like, I don't know if it's like just maybe it's because the problem is I want them to get back together. So if the point of the reason is like she doesn't want to live where he lives, and he doesn't want to live where she lives. I guess they could make that work later in life. Uh, yes. He travels for work to perform guitar, and she doesn't like how much he is away. That's an that's an that's an option. I didn't realize this is Sky. I'm still on Mamma Mia when Sky's a little Todd. Yes, the Sky. He's a lot older now. Maybe he's scared to have two kids. Maybe. I feel like I haven't been here in a while. And yeah, my racing starts next week. 
which happens to be Thursday, uh, Tuesday, Thursday, so I'll be again for a while. No, oh, well, you can always watch the past ones on my YouTube channel. Um, got accepted to a research fellowship. That is so exciting. Triforce 99. That definitely deserves a Dr. Pepper. Cheers. Bop, bop. I look like I'm in a little commercial. Cheers. Dr. Pepper. Wait. Blum. Nope. I, I suck at being in a commercial. Brum. That was almost it. That was almost it. That nice little, um, little camera <laughs> movement. She's doing really well in her career and has to go to the city, but he wants to live a slower life. Okay. They're too young and rushed with the wedding. They waited till marriage um, was sleeping together and they are incompatible. They have to mature. Mm, interesting. Okay. A choice, a choice, a choice. I like the idea that they're like, it's because they're too young. Maybe she changes as they age just so she misses him and realizes that she can have everything where Sky lives. Maybe she has to move for her career for now. Ah, oh, but then her job kind of changes to get older. I like that idea. I think you guys are all divorced because she wants to have a career on fashion and he wants one in the winery. Okay. I feel like that's fair. I feel like maybe Simone, wait, does she have a job? We don't have her have a job. So maybe she'll join a career after the twins are born and she'll have to move. Oh my God. They keep trying to like, oh, she's so hungry. Can you not eat that? Oh no, she can't eat that. Okay, let's cancel this. We can't eat anything in this house and she's really hungry. I mean, I guess we could order a pizza. You want to order a pizza? What is happening to her? Oh my goodness. Okay. Let's order a delivery. Let's order a pizza. Okay. What kind of pizza do we want? <gasps> tikka masala. Okay. I want to order a tikka masala pizza. That sounds really good. I'm kind of hungry. Can you tell? Neve dies because of leaving the house to Sky. He feels tied to the island and she wants a job in the city. Okay, I like that. Cuckoo banana rama. I think I think you're right. Alley Cat, thank you so much for the Twitch Prime sub. Dana Scarlet, thank you so much for two months. Recently finished putting my bedroom together. My bed has a little sensory cubby underneath. <gasps> what? No! Oh no! That deserves a Dr. Pepper, but oh my god! Sammy just died. I kinda thought we had more time with Sammy. I'm sorry. Oops, the dog died. I'm sorry. I didn't do it on purpose. No, Chad is upset with me. <laughs> you didn't show up to claim my pizza and le they left it outside. Okay, where's our pizza though? Where'd you put my pizza? Shoot, where'd you put it? Our dog is dying. No wonder we didn't come pick up our pizza, lady. What do you mean you put it outside? What does that mean? Where did you put it? Oh my God, I don't know where our pizza is. Dang it. Where, where, where is the front door of this house? Like what is, where? Eh, eh. Okay, well, I guess the pizza's the least of our worries because our dog's dying. Oh, our poor pregnant wife. It's fine, we'll get another dog. I don't think that's that's how not how it works, does it? Grim does not deserve a Dr. Pepper. Everyone deserves a Dr. Pepper except Grim for taking my dog away. Here you go, Chewy. No Dr. Pepper for you, Grim. Gonna have to do a Sammy too. Yeah. That was on me. I kind of meant to like prolong Sammy's life and then I forgot. I'm so sorry, guys. <laughs> Finally got some recognition from the work I've been doing for the past three plus years. Wasn't well, a big recognition, but it was still retcon condition. That deserves the Dr. Pepper. Baby, cheers. Cheers for that. That's huge. How much do you love your new room? I'm obsessed. I'm obsessed with this new room. Oh my gosh, I love it so much. Where? Okay, this is where my dogs... Well, I'm gonna have to bring the dog with me. I still do not know where they left our pizza. This is the worst. Oh my gosh. Maybe that's why they end their marriage. Their honeymoon was so tragic. <clears throat> oh my gosh. Look, she's uncomfortable with morning sickness. She's, ooh, she's starting her third trimester soon. We're gonna have our babies soon. All right, let's end this, okay? Let's go home. Let's go home. Can we end our, end our, like leave? I wanna go home now. Ma'am, sir, I want to end, right. end the vacation. <laughs> Our dog died and we're sad and we're talking to Grim. I don't want it.
Check the beach. Oh, well, it's too late. We're going home. Ugh. So sad. Do not like. Do you have any more, um, Dr. Pepper? Make sure to keep posting them. Oh my gosh. I want to celebrate your wins. I have also uh, a sneeze. Gosh. Oh. Okay, my poor pregnant wife would like some leftovers. Oh my gosh. Look, it's my mom. My mom and her husband now. She got married to old man Kiyoshi Ito. Neve. Oh no, that's uh, that's Sky. I was like. Someone went to fall asleep. Everyone's fine though. Everyone's good. <laughs> thank you for the bless you. That Nikki Hoopy, thank sure. you so much for 25 months. I passed the SAT, congratulations. Sure. That definitely deserves a Dr. Pepper. Oh my gosh. Get yourself a sweet treat with a Dr. Pepper. Oh my gosh. Big or small, all wins are moments where you deserve a Dr. Pepper. And that one's a big win. That is a big win. <laughs> Cleaned my whole room and finished a product review for school today. That is huge. Cleaned your whole room? Oh my gosh. That's a lot. Oh, Neve. She's so sad because Sammy's gone. Poor Neve. She's talking to Billy about it. Give her a little cheerful. Wait, you don't even know Billy and you're chatting with Billy? Okay. Simone's having a nice. Oh, her dad's calling. I think Jade Rosa is pretty cute. Yeah, you know what? Dad, you you go for it, okay? You go for it. I, I believe in you, Dad. You go date who you want. Oh my gosh. Billy's outfit is on point. Billy is, has always been a fashion icon. And for some reason, I do not ever want to touch Billy's wardrobe. I just think it's so fun. Whatever Billy wears is just so fun that I like don't care to give Billy uh like a makeover. I think Billy Billy is ahead of <laughs> Billy's time. And it's just better. Dipple K, thank you so much for gifting a sub to Silverwing. What's that sound? A wild Oprah beard! Ashton got a new job! That is so exciting! Congratulations! That deserves the Dr. Pepper. Ooh, Prof. get be a little Amundial indulgent today Billy. with your Dr. Yeah, Pepper. Bar, you know what I mean? <clears throat> okay. Neve is just... Oh, why don't you call a little sadness hotline? I know everyone um, has told me before that that one's a good one to get over some sadness. Is Simone sad? Oh. She's also sad about witnessing that pet death. Mm. Why is she so happy about her marriage and her baby? It's hard for her to be super sad as a mom of three kids under five and stay at home mom doing online schooling for work to work in the medical uh, uh -huh. medical oh sorry I, I, I wasn't able to read that whole thing but that is huge honestly you deserve a Dr. Pepper from the first word for being a mom you deserve a Dr. Pepper I didn't even need to read the rest to know that you deserve a big win okay <laughs> okay Pulls, thank you so much for four months <laughs> I'm glad that Neve is not dead yet I, I'm pretty sure she's gonna die really soon, but like it's been really nice having her around, you know, like helping them kind of, kind of get uh, their life in order. What, well, Sky? Why don't you clean that for mom? Okay, clean that for your mother. It's okay, Sky. Simone's feeling flirty. She's just like, I'm living my best life. I'm pregnant. I'm married. I'm young. I'm in love. <clears throat> oh, I still love this. Even though we like suffered so hard for this painting, I actually kind of love it. I think it's a fabulous painting. It's amazing. Also, wait, while we still have Neve, maybe we should have her do some more paintings, get some money, you know? Go paint your feelings, Neve, about losing Sammy the dog. Sky's cleaning up the toilet for for the for the the ladies in his life. Oh, and uh, Simone's helping out clean the house. That deserves a Dr. Pepper. Celebrating being married for 20 years next week. Oh my gosh. I'm trying to be like you. <laughs> oh my gosh. <coughs> Make her paint a maternity pic. <gasps> That'd be so cute. Also, how cute are they? They're making out. Okay. We'll have her 
But if we paint the maternity pics, we can't sell it. She's trying to sell stuff so she can provide for the family after she's gone. But yeah, a maternity pic would be kind of cute. Are you going to add to the house more? Yes. Yes. Once Neve's gone, I think I'm going to add to the house. I'm going to redo the house. Probably next stream. We'll do redo the house. Here you go, Chewie. She was trying to steal my chips. Mmm. Malia, thank you so much for gifting us up to Tim Wars. A wild Oprah appeared. You are in the top 20 most viewers live today. Oh my gosh. Well, thanks everybody for tuning in. If you're new here, hi, I'm Kelsey Dangerous. I'm a variety Twitch streamer, but mostly I just stream The Sims. Uh, and today we're trying out my short lifespan challenge and we're enjoying a nice, refreshing, indulgent Dr. Pepper and celebrating our wins, big and small. My win for this week, I mean, it is only Tuesday. So <laughs> I still have plenty of wins to, ahead of me. But my win for this week is like the launch of this um, new backdrop, my, my new office. That's probably my biggest win for this week. Pregnant with my fifth child. <gasps> Five children. You're doing your own baby challenge right there. Congratulations. That's super duper exciting. Oh, also another big win is I've been um, working on writing my book, uh, writing the second draft, and I've like been like really dedicated to writing my second draft of my novel. So that's been a huge win for me. I finished a whole chapter yesterday in one day. So that was really excited uh, doing a draft of a whole chapter. Also, look at this beautiful art that she's doing. This de That definitely deserves a Dr. Pepper, I think. <laughs> mm -mm -mm. What's your book on? I have not I have not just closed any details of the book that I'm writing, but I have said that it is a uh, fiction book. So it is not it's not a like a tell all or a personal thing. Um, I'm back from the office after so long working from home and I'm here despite the intense anxiety. Congratulations. I can do this. You can. You've got this. I'm so proud of you. Oh, look at these two cuties. All right. We're going to definitely sell that to the gallery. Her little sad art piece. Look at look at him just running out to trying to be like, you did amazing, sweetie. <laughs> so cute, Kyo. She wants to flirt with her. He's like, I want to flirt with you. Neve's like, I need to pee. Give me a second. I need to pee. My oldest daughter loves Dr. Pepper. I liked it when I was a kid. Oh, nice. Ooh, Dr. Pepper's so good. Kelsey's book, Kelsey's book, Kelsey's book. Oh, thanks, Sarah. Ooh, I'm so nervous. I do need to get some new treats for Chewy's jar. I'm not gonna lie. <clears throat> it's my dog's fifth birthday next week, which is a win for him because of all of his health issues. That's huge. My therapist said he was proud of me. That is huge, Twisted Sister. I remember my therapist told me she was proud of me like recently, and I was like, ah! she's like, you handled that situation well. I was like, the validation is so great. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for the validation. All right. So Neve is going to come back here. She's going to she's going to finally sell her her masterpiece to the gallery. Yes, Neve, sell it, baby. Excellent. And look who came out to talk to her but Simone. That is so sweet. Okay, why don't you do a nice painting from reference of of uh Simone? Simone, stay right there. Don't move. Don't move. Don't move. Don't move, Simone. Don't move, Simone, okay? Don't move. You're perfect. You're perfect. Okay, shoot. You might be too close. I can't see your belly. Wait, nope. There's the belly. Perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Okay? That That's, uh, oh. Okay, right there, right there. Thank you, Chewie. Chewie's licking my ankle right now. You can't see it because he's like, mom, mom, give me the, give me the goods, mom. Look at this. Look at this guilty little man. Get out of there. Stop licking my ankles. He's like, I just want more. I just want more. Give me the good stuff, mom. <laughs> oh my gosh. 78 novels in four months. Wait, does someone, someone's flexing on me right now in the chat. I'm literally on my fifth book. Oh, wow. <laughs> that definitely deserves a Dr. Pepper. Congratulations, everyone. That isn't me. <laughs> mm. Oh, that's true, dude. She does have her own painting in the background of that uh -huh. photo. Branca. That's like some painting inception, right? She painted, and her painting's in the background. <laughs> there is a Vladdy Daddy emote. Do you love it? The Magical Cat, thank you so much for two months. Oh, no. 
Sky Mason has the emotion bomb quirk now. No, Sky. It's okay though, because Sky's gonna lose his fame and therefore his emotion bomb quirk very quickly. So it's fine. He's gonna probably play sad guitar. There he goes. Playing his little guitar, whipping it out whenever he wants. Look how cute she is. She's just, you know, painting, painting her daughter-in-law. Look at, look at <laughs> Simone just watching this goof of a man play guitar for her. Oh my goodness, Chewie is just very chaotic right now. He is chaotically existing and we love this for him. I'm about to send my husband to get me chips and Dr. Pepper. Honestly, chips and Dr. Pepper is the move. Get yourself a bag of chips, get yourself a Dr. Pepper, give yourself a treat, okay? This is a win. Make sure to keep using the command DP for, uh, so I can highlight your wins. That's how I know to put them on the screen. Mm. Wait, is, are you done? No, she's not done yet. But how, this has actually turned out real cute. I kind of wish we would have seen more of the side of the bump, but it's all good. It's all good. <laughs> Why is there a child at my door? Are you selling cookies? Why don't you go home? Okay, we don't know you. You're just a child. Stranger danger. I worked on a full eight hour shift and went grocery shopping afterwards. Full day of adulting. <laughs> that definitely is Dr. Sure. Pepper. I ate my veggies today. <laughs> nice. Then you de then you deserve a Dr. Pepper right after. It's called balance, baby. It's called balance, all right? We gotta indulge yourself. You gotta treat yourself. I mean, this thing has 23 different flavors. It is a it is a bunch of flavors in your mouth. My job extended our work from home policy until June. Yes! That is exciting. Mm. Yes, 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 yes. Oh, first time chat. Welcome, CCC Cowboy. Hope you stick around. Make sure to hit that follow button if you haven't already and you're interested in hanging out with us. Got a random tiny raise out of nowhere at my job. Wait, that is so exciting. Heck yeah. That deserves a Dr. Pepper. Congratulations. Oh, he just wants to keep expressing his fondness of Maeve. How cute is that? Or Neve, I'm sorry. I think he needs to call a little sadness outline about his dog. Oh, Simone's just sitting over here reading, just being a cutie. She still has her wedding henna. Like, it's not even much time has passed. Not even that much time has passed. My Dr. Pepper is all warm. I have to wait for it to get cold in the fridge. Okay, so I put mine in the freezer for a little bit and it got nice and cold. Or just pour it over some ice cubes. That's what ice cubes are for. I got a new job in a different country and will be moving. Oh, congratulations. That's really exciting. You're living my dream. I feel like that was my dream. Before I got a job at BuzzFeed, I actually wanted to move out of the country. And then I got the job at BuzzFeed and I was like, I guess I'm not doing that. And then uh, this all happened. So I regret nothing. <laughs> Watch my former grad student defend and get her PhD. That is huge. Congratulations. Flatty Day works in my peach gen lab tech. In the detective career, are you kidding me? Twisted sister, that is so funny. <laughs> I don't want to see Vladdy Daddy at work. I don't. Wait, why was that only 10 simoleons? Stop that. Don't pour that money away. Put it down. Put it down and nobody gets hurt. What did you, where did you just put it? Sir? Sir? You put it in the shower hovering. Sims logic. It was floating in the shower. Look at that. See? 40 simoleons right there. 40 simoleons right there. <laughs> I love that there's not enough room at the table, the dining table for all four of these <laughs> Uncomfortable, thank you so much. A while. Ooh, congrats on unpacking. That's a big one. You definitely deserve a Dr. Pepper. Uncomfortable, thank you so much for five gifted subs to the community. Welcome to Loving Arms of the Danger Zone. Uh, just joined your new setup. Looks beautiful. Thank you so much, Jessica. I'm super duper proud of it. Um, presented and got recognized for the research on Cambodian health I've been conducting. That is huge. Congratulations. Big win. You got to celebrate. <clears throat> so many potential recruits into our cult. Oh no. We're not a cult. Okay? We're not a cult. Welcome to our quest for world domination. Just finished up watching all the laundry and bedding in the house. Oh my gosh, that's the best feeling. When you like get into your bed and it's all clean and you're like, oh, amazing. Gorgeous. Love the feeling. You're like, I'm queen clean personified. I've never felt this clean in my life. I'll never feel this clean again. 
Being out of laundry, oh my gosh, it's so rare to see the bottom of my laundry basket. And when I see it, I'm like, oh my god. Am I better than everyone else? Blue made Bebdo. Oh, Shimuk Warg. All right. <clears throat> There's a very awkward encounter. Why is it awkward? What are you guys talking about? Is it because she's flirting with you in front of your um, father? I was gonna say stepfather, but technically he's not his stepfather. Is this is this real father? <clears throat> Simone. Oh, wait. And why is randomly Kyoshi's flirty, too? Kyoshi's like, I want to kiss my wife. They both just got married. They're all in their honeymoon phase in a house together. Probably not the best start of a relationship, to be quite honest with us. I love this family. Honestly, same. The laundry basket has a bottom. I know, right? Who would have known? Not me. Not me. I have a laundry. I have two laundry baskets. One on top of the other one. One's the hamper, I guess. And one's the, like, basket that you move. Is she flirting with Kyoshi? No, she wasn't flirting with Kyoshi. See, look. They're just, they're barely even friends. They were not flirting together. They just both happen to be flirty around the same time. Weird coincidence, though. It's weird that it happened twice. <laughs> I'm currently working on my master's degree in English. That's huge. I just finished my first semester of my bachelor's degree after being out of school for half a year. That is huge. It is so hard to go back to school. So shout out to you. That definitely deserves a Dr. Pepper. Uh -huh. Cheers. You're on the front page of Twitch. I know, right? What's up, front page? How you guys doing? You deserve a Dr. Pepper. I deserve a Dr. Pepper for being on the front page of Twitch. Uh, about to finish my thesis after eight long months. Yes, we love to see it. Congratulations. That is a lot of time. That's, that thesis is practically a child. You... You're birthing a child, and the child is your thesis, Dahlia. Congratulations. All right, yeah, you go to sleep. I love that everyone's everyone's in their little beds. Look at this little family. So cute. We love to see it. You're the Busby girl. Yeah, I, I formerly the Busby girl. Now, girl who lives at our own channel. See, I knew Sky would le leave the celebrity level behind. It's fine, Sky. Move on. Move on, you don't. Oh, it's sad seeing Ghost Sammy. Ghost Sammy. They were best friends. Simone, are you gonna have a baby yet? Okay, third trimester in three hours. Not quite yet, but I think by the end of this stream, we're gonna be having a baby. Hey, Kelsey, we love you, Queen. Thank you. I move in with my boyfriend. Congratulations! That definitely deserves a Dr. Pepper. Grab, grab, grab two. You know, bring your. You could like, you walk in to the place. You know, you're moving in, and you're like, I think this deserves a special treat. And you open it up. Boom! It's a Dr. Pepper. Who's gonna say no to that? No one. Everyone's gonna love that. Ten out of ten. I'm glad Neve is still alive. I. Ha uh, I'm glad Neve is still alive too. I'm continuously nervous. I feel like I'm just like sitting in wait for the eventuality of her death. My win is that I've been working full-time shifts and doing school at the same time. That is huge. Uh -huh. You definitely deserve a Dr. Pepper. <gasps> treat yourself to that rich, sweet Dr. Pepper treat. <laughs> did I mean to rhyme? I did not. Ha <laughs> ha, look at me. That's a win of mine that I just rhymed. It was not good, but it was, it was there, you know. I'm not out here trying to be like the next poet and or lyricist, okay? Not uh, a rain. Thank you so much for gifting us up. What's that sound? <gasps> A wild Oprah appears! Clean my whole apartment. I have a massive anxiety, but manage doing all, uh, going to my apartment's gym instead of my all women's gyms. That is huge. Congratulations. Mm -mm. Uh, but also, um, can I come to your all women's gym? Because that also sounds like a lot of fun. I need to check out an all women's gym. I'm sure there's one in my area. That sounds like so much fun to go in and just be like hyping each other up. Like I just imagine an all women's gym would be like when you're drunk at a bar and you go to the bathroom and it's just all women and you're all like vibing each other. It's the best, it's the best. That's how I picture an all women's gym. And if it isn't like that, I don't want it. They're the best. Okay, now I'm like kind of convinced. Now I kind of feel like I need it. Oh, now she's picking up his guitar. She's like, two can play at that, babes. Oh, wow, she's not good. She's even worse. Wait, how does she have this guitar? Whose guitar is that? Does Neve still have her guitar? Neve does not have her guitar. Okay, I have a feeling that for some reason, Simone has Neve's guitar, which honestly, that's fine. That's fine. Oh, even he's sad. 
He's sad about the dog dying. Oh my gosh, the whole family, even Kiyoshi, who knew the dog for two seconds, is sad about the dog dying. Here, we're gonna add add uh, this painting to our wall, our gallery wall of um, familial paintings. We just, we only have family paintings now at this uh, at this juncture. Oh, even our dog's on the wall. Oh, I pressed the wrong button. Look away, look away, ah! I feel like I'm the, like the <laughs> Wizard of Oz, where you're like, don't look behind the curtain. I flew a kite for the first time ever and I felt like magic. I'm in my 30s, so late to the game. Oh my gosh, kites are awesome. Also, my dog is so cute, just sitting under there. Hello, hello, sir. He's like, please, mom, I would, mom, I would just like one, one chip, please, mom. Currently drinking a Dr. Pepper Zero because I start a new work from home job this Friday. Yes, Alley Cat. I want to say these are not mundane wins. You guys are thriving. I'm so happy for everyone and their wins. Yes. Do not downplay your wins, okay? They all deserve a Dr. Pepper. Graduated college and I'm working on my master's degree. That's huge, Chrissy. Yes. Dr. Pepper is the best. Agreed. Agreed. I don't drink soda a ton, but I, I'm a sucker for a Dr. Pepper. I'm not even lying to you guys. Also, one of my best friends always has a Dr. Pepper every time I go to the movies. So when I drink Dr. Pepper, I think of some of my best friends and like good moments together. All right, go take a shower, sir. And then you can have a snack. You can have food and take it. Okay, whatever. Whatever order you want. I don't care. Neve, Simone's like, oh, I accidentally called Simone Neve. Simone like playing her guitar. Yeah, she's just practicing. I feel like it's because I don't have a TV in this house. So all the Sims are like, I don't know what to do with myself, but we're chilling. We're waiting for these babies to pop out or someone to die, <laughs> which sounds super sad, but I'm sorry. I'm not sorry. Me graduating this year and being the first in my family to finish school. That is really flipping huge. Congratulations. Okay. That is mad mad props that is such a big win oh my gosh i'm so happy for you do you get a dr pepper to celebrate launching my small business <gasps> sarah let's go that is huge i have not seen the new fantastic beast movie i'm not going to i know that sounds really harsh i i was a diehard harry potter fan growing up but eh, number one everything with jk rowling we don't love it and number two, the last movie wasn't that good. And number three, I need more gay Dumbledore and they were not giving me enough gay Dumbledore and I think that's trash. So I'm not gonna watch it. Was it any good? Did you guys like it? Just received my driver's license in the mail, yo! <laughs> the reason they get divorced is because Simone stole his mom's guitar. <gasps> I feel like his mom would have given it to her, but I mean, that could be it. She's still so sad about the pet. Oh, poor baby. Poor baby. Let's, um, let's call the sadness hotline again. Okay. You're fine, sweetie. Why don't you, oh, I'm going to clean out the food. I feel like there's like spoiled food in here. Yep, there is. There's some bad gross food here. I'm gonna throw that away. And then, um, Sky, why don't you cook a meal for everybody? Why don't you cook, ooh, veggie dumplings, please. That sounds really good. There's so much more gay double door in the new movie. Oh man, okay. Okay. I'm, I'm kind of convinced that <laughs> I did want a lot of gay double door. Just received my driver's license in the mail. That is exciting, yes! I read it twice, but I don't care. It's still exciting. <laughs> Drive around, have some fun, go get yourself a Dr. Pepper. You know what I'm saying? You drive to a local store, fill up your whole car. No one can stop you. I remember when I first got my license, like that's kind of what I want to do. I just wanted to take random adventures. I just saw it for free, so JK got none of my money. Maybe that's what I'll try to do. <laughs> give a DP to mother that gave birth to nine children. Oh yeah, we got to give a Dr. Pepper to a mother that gave birth to nine children. Is that you? Jake, oh my God. I was trying to say hey and like geez and they and they went to Jay. Got out of bed this morning. That deserves a Dr. Pepper. Cheers, that is big deal. Look at us, look at us. Who would have thought? Not me, not me. Look at him cooking. What are you cooking, sir? Oh, the vegetable, literally the thing that I, wow, I have the memory of a goldfish. I was like, what is he doing? I don't know. He's cooking. He's doing the thing that you asked him to do, Kelsey. 
Honestly, though, pretty rare for... Uh, <laughs> I was, <just, laughs> was going to say something so sad. I was going to be like, pretty rare for a man. <laughs> that was... I'm, I'm, <laughs> I'm just teasing. But I'm just saying... You know, sometimes you ask someone to do something and they haven't to be, and more often than not, if it's a woman, it gets done. <laughs> you know what? He, but he finished that meal. He deserves a Dr. Pepper. <laughs> I'm just teasing. I'm just, oh, oh my gosh. I like look down and they're making out. I'm like, um, should I be here? Excuse me? Um, I think nobody should be... Actually, you know what? Sky can do this. I was like, none of... They're too old to be fixing this mess. And she is pregnant. So I don't want to risk any of their lives. You know what? Let's just replace it. We'll replace it. Okay? Yeah. We'll replace it for mom. Mom can go out... Ooh, she's feeling focused. Mom can go out and uh, paint another masterpiece. How about that, mom? Do like a mathematical diagram. Oh, she's just flirting with her husband. They are shameless. They're obsessed with each other. I like how shameless all of my Sims are with each other. Yeah. <laughs> They're just obsessed. Wow. It's a lot. Oh. Giving Harry Styles at Coachella energy I to the ball of the boyfriends <laughs> out there. <laughs> well, you know. Be wrong. I'm not wrong. I'm sorry. <laughs> Listen, I have a lot more jokes like that, but we just have to all agree that Kelsey's not talking about everyone and it's fine, okay? They're just It's just in good faith and it's, just, it's jokes. I got a promotion in managing other people. Oh, That's exciting. Yeah. Good job. What do you think of Moon Knight? New Marvel series. Love it. Only seen the first two episodes. For some reason, I haven't been uh, pulled back to see the third episode, but I feel like I should keep watching. Uh, why does he have a matching bed as his mom? Um, because I was lazy and I haven't done like the remodel. Okay. He still has like teenage posters on the wall. Like it's it's just a mess. Okay. We just, we just bought the same bed and then we bought the same bed frame and the same comforter quilts or whatever like you know it happens <laughs> oh it's the same one that she put in his bedroom well there you have it it's the same one. Oh, look at them all hanging out look at them all look at them look at these guys i love this little family moon knight is so good okay okay i need to i need to rewatch it paint a picture of kiyoshi so sky can have it oh that's sweet yeah i should paint a picture of kiyoshi Actually, Sky, can you take a photo with Kiyoshi? Take a photo with Kiyoshi. Oh wait, 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 wait. I want it. I want it on your computer, on your like camera. Yes, take a photo picture with Kiyoshi. Oh, and Simone. Wait, they could all take. Okay, they're all three of them can take a photo together. That's really cute. I want him to take a more of a photo with just with Kiyoshi though. But that's so cute. Okay, he's gonna go take a photo with oh. Kyoshi. <laughs> a father son photo. <laughs> a delicious. <laughs> Are you gonna do a video tour of your new room? I think I will. Do you guys, do you wanna see one? I'm going on my first family vacay since my hubby and I got together. <gasps> that's so exciting. I have so much fun. That deserves oh, a duck to pepper. <laughs> <clears throat> oh, is he coming? Hurry up! Hurry up, Kyoshi! I know you're old. Yep. Are you not coming? Your your son is literally waiting. Wait for photographer. Okay, you guys all need to help here. Okay. Go take a photo of them. Okay. Help, Ms. Wife, help your. There we go. Oh, that's really cute, guys. Look at this. Look, it looks like he's just looking at his dad. They look so sweet together. You can really see the resemblance in uh, in Sky's eyes. Oh, and honestly, maybe their noses are kind of actually their lips are dead on the same, dead on the same lips and eyebrows and eyes. A hundred percent. So cute. Okay, wait, 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 wait. All right, all right. We get another. It'd be like a like a goofy pick. This didn't happen last time I tried to pick a picture of two people. What about what about this one? Oh, I love it. I'm just gonna keep taking all of them in the different poses. Okay, next pose. Oh, cool boys. Okay, cool boys. Okay, next pose. Post. Oh, laughing together. A classic. A classic. If you're ever like 
how do I take a, a picture of me and my friends where it looks like we're like hanging out? Everybody look at each other and laugh. Laugh, like force a laugh, and then eventually the forced laugh will become a real laugh. Finally, finished outlining my book today. Yeah, that deserves a Dr. Pepper. Cheers, that is huge. I know that is always a big deal, okay? Out outlining books is no joke. Oh, this is them feeling sad about the dog, but we don't need a photo of that. Yeah, look at them. Look at them. Oh my gosh. Kyoshi's gonna be a grandpa. That's what that one is. Let's do, let's do another one of them together. Oh my gosh, these are so cute. These are so funny. I'm obsessed. I'm obsessed. Family photo shoot. Mm, 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 mm. Yes. Oh no! Ah! Oh my God, are you kidding me? Oh my God, we got those photos of Kyoshi and then he died. God. And look at look at our beautiful woman. She's like, oh no, she just realized he died. Wait, that's all that this this is like really not worth much. Are you kidding me? Oh my gosh. Neve! Poor Neve! She only had a couple days with him. It's so sad. It's like he waited to take the photos with his son. Oh my gosh. I know, they both got so little time with him. A little bit short lifespan challenge. Ugh, the challenge is that you may not, oh my God. The challenge is that the, you don't get much time with all of your loved ones and everything sucks. Okay, let's, let's start like a little graveyard back here for all of my <laughs> dead sims of this challenge. Okay, quick, we need to take photos with mom before. <laughs> we need to take photos of mom before she hits, kicks it too. Get out of here, Grim. Just finished making a bunch of shirts to sell at my school in a fashion class. That's so cool. C congratulations. Cheers. That deserves a Dr. Pepper. That's really exciting. You know what drink will help them get over the tra trauma? You tell me. You tell me what drink gets over the trauma. My divorce was finalized today. Oh my gosh. Congratulations. That deserves a Dr. Pepper. Cheers. Go treat yourself with a sweet treat. Neef, 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 neef. Darling, darling, darling. I know you're mourning. I need a photo from both of you. Please, please, please. I need you both to come here for this photo because I, I need it, okay? I, I, I'm I afraid that you're gonna die and I'm not gonna have any photos of you two together. Neve, She's just like, I'm eating. Let me eat my emotion food in peace, Kelsey. I'm like, no, Neve. What if you kick it next? I need a photo of you with your son. Stop eating these, okay? Stop crying. <laughs> go get the photos. Go, go do the, no, don't do that. Okay, here we, okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try again, okay? I'm gonna, I'm gonna try again. We're gonna try one more time. She's feeling very inspired. I'm glad that you're feeling inspired to take some photos. She's like, I feel like, oh no, she hadn't seen what's happening. All right, come on, please, please come take the photos. There we go, okay, perfect. Oh no, they're both so sad. They're like, do we really need to take more family photos after the death of my husband and his, his, uh, oh my God. No, 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 no. Let's, let's get some goofy ones. Okay. Let's get some, let's get some happy ones. Let's, let's get some happy. She still looks miserable. Okay. Here's one. Here's one. That's good. Between mother and son. Wait, hold on. I need one. That's a little, there we go. That one's good. That one's good. Okay. Great. Switch the pose. Switch it. Maybe a cool one. Cool pose. Yeah. Oh, wait. That's the one that you just took, Kyoshi. <laughs> a different one. No, a different one. Stop doing the same pose. Ah, you just did that with Kyoshi before he died, too. All right. No more cool poses. Cool pose is too emotional. Let's do this one. They did that one, too, with Kyoshi. Oh, my gosh. The Sims only have, like, three poses, apparently. Thoughtful. Let's, uh, let's just, let's just, uh, Okay. We're, we're trying here. They're, they're cheering up a little bit. Let's, 
Oh, these all are just the same. Oh, that one's really sweet. This one's really sweet. Okay. Oh, so sad. Okay, we took all those photos. Oh. Neve, can you take a photo of the newlyweds? I don't know if we have that many photos of them together. So take take it of what? Oh no, it's him. I'm on him instead of Neve. They're all so sad. Oh my gosh. Take a photo. Of, I know it's a terrible time to continue family photo time, but I really want this. So you guys are gonna have to just let me let me have this. Okay? Let me have this, Sims. Get over there. Pose for the camera. They're both so sad. She's like, I'm doing fine, and he's miserable. I don't blame him. Poor baby. I did carpet clean my room and the stairs and my couch, uh, the stairs, my couch, and did my kids' laundry. That is a lot of work today. See, look, isn't this weird? They won't like touch each other in the photos. Okay, that one almost looks like she is touching him. But I'm like, isn't that odd? Like, I feel like all of their photos, they don't like hug each other or whatever. They're like always separated. It's so odd to me. Okay, yeah, we have had photos of them together. I don't know what that is. It's fine. You know what? Whatever. It's fine. It's fine. They why they they that's why they get divorced. Their love fizzles out. Apparently. Well no, I think they're always passionate for each other because they're gonna get back together later. I think just maybe like, I don't know, the death of his family members and then her being like, I wanna move. He's gonna be like, I can't move. They're literally buried in the the backyard. Like, I can't move. And she's like, but this is my dream. And he's like, well, screw you. Like, maybe he's just like hurt and upset. I think that makes sense. I did all the laundry and put it all away in the same day. I have four boys and a husband. So it took six hours. That deserves a Dr. Pepper. Oh my gosh. Will Neve survive the episode? What? Oh my gosh. You guys are all... You guys are so morbid. You're taking bets on if Neve is gonna kick it? I mean, honestly, I would bet against her as well, but still. Still. Okay, Neve, why don't you. Oh my god, you poor baby angel. She didn't get to paint her husband. I mean, uh, technically, we could put up a like a picture of him. Oh, poor baby. You could take a. Like, you could grab one of these photos of him. Hold on. Uh -huh. Wait, where are the photos of uh, of him and his father? Oh, here they are. Oh, Like this one? Can they like... I know she can paint from like a photo. Maybe we'll do like this. Well, I thought this was supposed to be bigger, but I guess I just didn't size it up. All right, what if we did this? We'll just put this here. And then like painted that. Can we do that? We'll do it after. Can we do it house expansion soon? Yes, we'll be doing that next time. Cute. Thank you so, uh, so much for the Twitch Prime stuff. <laughs> Who will survive? Oh my God, you actually are taking bets now. <laughs> How are Kyoshi's other children? I feel like Kyoshi's other children. Let's see. Pretty sure they're mostly teens. Yeah, they're all high school students. And uh, this one, who I think is a middle school. Oh, so sad. Poor Kiyoshi. Rip Kiyoshi, rip. Guess what? My day with Jade Ro uh, Razoya went very well. Okay, Dad, good for you. He deserves a Dr. Pepper for having a good date. Ooh, has anyone else gone on a date recently? Good or bad? Share the tea with me. I'll, drink, I'll sip my Dr. Pepper as I read your tea. Let's, let's spend those channel points. You guys are killing me. An actual prediction. Hey, you're making predictions with me. Do at home dates count? Sure. Yeah, why not? My win is passing both of my classes with four weeks left of the semester. That is huge. Congratulations. That deserves a Dr. Pepper for sure. I went on a date on Sunday. It went well. That deserves a Dr. Pepper. Heck yeah. Ooh, was that a masterpiece? Did you just do a masterpiece? Uh, oh, 
Yeah, she did. Coach him. They're very rare. Not for Neve, apparently. Neve is a masterpiece making machine. All right, let's paint a medium painting from reference and see if we can reference this over here. Whoop. Yeah, okay. Almost perfect, actually. Aw. There we go. She painted those two from this. That's, okay, that'll work. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, Neve is gonna. <laughs> that means Neve's gonna die, guys. I hate to say it, but when it, when this starts doing that, it means she's gonna die. I don't know when, I don't, but like within the next day, the next 24 hours, I'm pretty sure Neve's gonna die. Maybe if Neve isn't dead yet, Skylar divorces because he doesn't want to leave his mom behind and Simone needs to move for her job. Oh, that's true. I wanted to them to divorce right after the kids are born. So I guess it just depends on like what all is happening. Cause I feel like, oh, she's third trimester. She could give birth any moment and Neve could die any moment. <laughs> We're just in a waiting pattern. We're in a holding pattern. I got divorced last year and now taking care of myself. That deserves a Dr. Pepper. Let's go. We love to see it. In two minutes? Wait, it's gonna be in two minutes. Are you kidding? Is Neve gonna finish this painting and then croak? Sure. That was the meanest way of putting that I've ever said. Oh my gosh. Not my points. Oh no, I'm so sorry to those who um, who get bet that Neve wouldn't die. My girlfriend and I live long distance because she works in the film industry, but we're about to celebrate our three year anniversary. That is huge. Congratulations. Logan? Uh. <clears throat> Ooh, complete 10 excellent painting. Oh no, oh no, oh no. Neve, Neve, Neve. The way she walked over there made me nervous. <laughs> made me nervous. Neve, why don't you, why don't you take it easy, okay? Yeah, she's gonna go cry it out in her bed. That's probably for the best, okay? That's good, that's good. Uh, Tommy would like to come over and hang out. Yeah, Tommy, come on over. You know, we, we could use a pick me up. Cause right now is pretty tragic over here, okay? A dog died, my dad died. We need, we need our bestie here. Tommy, Tommy's coming Talking over. Girl. Good job. If you ask her to her advice, be like, oh, my dad died. It's really tragic. So tragic. I also want Simone and Tommy to be friends. So I want her to get to know Tommy. Uh, invite her to feel the baby. Oh wait, we have bills to pay by the way too. I just remembered. Let's go pay our bills. All right. Yes. Denise. Girls supporting girls, Denise. baby. Yeah, Besties, God. bestie moments. All right, let's um. Unbelievable. Story. They're getting to know each other. Look at her. she's like, oh, feel the baby. Ask about her hobbies and skills. We're we're becoming besties. It was about guitar solos. Apparently, me, uh, Simone is now super into guitar. What will be Fox's career? Uh, will you have to student to the Not So Very Challenge to see? Finishing teaching one of the hardest school years yet and getting married in 42 days. That definitely deserves a Dr. Pepper. Congratulations. Did she sell it? Who saw? Sell what? This painting? <gasps> Wait, did I sell the painting? I think I might have sold it. It was it was automatic, okay? It was impulse. Mother of pearl. Mother of pearl. Okay, give me a second. I'll paint it again. I forgot, okay? I like... Uh, listen, all right. I... Oh, look, it's her journal. I'm going to give that to our son. I'm gonna give all of this stuff to her son just in case she dies. I don't want to lose anything in her inventory. Okay, uh, what's this? The rare eyes of Sulani. Ooh, okay, we're keeping that. Okay, but anyway. Sorry, Neve. You're gonna have to paint again. I wanted to give you a break, but I'm requiring you to paint this photo of them together because I'm a dingus and I'm a dingus. We all, we all knew I was a dingus. But that's not a new thing. The fact that I completely ruined it uh, is not new. You know, that's that. That's a pretty usual thing for me to do. <laughs> to impulsively uh, sell a painting and forget. You know, we'll do it again. It's fine. Neve is not dead yet. So she's going back out. She's like, I, pay I, I sold it because it was too hard, but I know my son will want it. So she's going to 
Uh -huh. Slap up a toy. All right, let's uh, let's be friendly. Let's tell the wedding story. Tell an engaging story. Okay, here we go. Boop, 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 boop. There it is. See, even better than last time. Okay. There you go. Maybe a little bit zoomed out. There you have it. Even better than last time. Yay! Better than last time. She just, she sold that first one because it wasn't as good. It wasn't as good as she knew she could make it. That's what, that's what's important. Ask about her day. How do you pronounce her name? It's Neve. Neve is her name. Like 90% sure that's how you pronounce it, but you can always tell me I'm wrong. I made a big progress of a commissioned portrait today. That is super exciting. That definitely deserves a doctor cover. Cheers. Did YB's fiance see the sim you created of them? I haven't actually asked. I should ask. All right, I want them to like become besties and it's taking forever. So I think they should take a photo together. Shortcut, baby. Neem. It's Neem? Neem. Well, there's a there's like a content creator on um, TikTok and she pronounces it Neem, I believe. So I'm just pronouncing it like her. Overcame my social anxiety and actually interacted with people today. That is huge. Congratulations. You deserve a Dr. Pepper as well. <laughs> Oh, Tommy and him got a sentiment <laughs> together. How are you guys? How's your guys' friendship going? <laughs> She's just being so flirtatious. Neve, are you done? He's still working on it. It looks great, even better than the last one. He's crying out his uh, father's stuff. She's just like in such a. Are you flirting with her? I don't think they're flirting. I hate that Sims just when they're flirty just speak flirtatiously to everyone. It's so weird. For my husband, who did a ton of yard work and cooking dinner every night. Oh my gosh, he deserves a Dr. Pepper. That's very sweet that you mentioned someone else. That's very sweet. All right, go get that photo with Tomi before she leaves, okay? I don't care that you need to pee. I asked you to do this minutes ago so you guys could become best friends. Thank you. I want them to be... She thinks photography is terrible. I don't care. This is how you make friends, okay? I don't care that you think photography is terrible. All right, go to the bathroom. Go use the bathroom. Oh my gosh. Are you kidding me? Go repair that. This is a nightmare. This house is falling apart. Poor Neve. Oh, but look, we have a painting. Wouldn't it be funny if I like deleted it again? I won't, I won't, I won't. But wouldn't it, it would be kind of funny, right? <laughs> like a little bit, like a little funny. No, not at all. Okay. I thought it would be. I'd be like two for two, baby. <laughs> All right, we're gonna put it here. There we go. The walls are covered in these paintings. I think in the in the next build, we're gonna have to like spread them out a bit. Did you use the toilet, darling? She did, but she has to wash her hands in the other room because the that one's ruined. Almost all of the seeds I planted for my garden have sprouted. That is huge. That definitely deserves a Dr. Pepper. That's impressive. I do not know how to do that. Ah. <laughs> uh. Yes, uh, would be, yeah, it would be a V sound at the end, Neve, uh, in Gaelic. No, M-H equals a V. So I am saying it right. Nice, nice. That deserves a Dr. Pepper. Get that sweet treat. Wins, uh, big or small wins are moments where you definitely deserve a Dr. Pepper. It is rich, has 32 flavors, is one of a kind, just like you. I'm craving a Dr. Pepper and I literally have one next to me. Every time I talk about it, I'm like, oh, I should be drinking a Dr. Pepper. I'm trying to drink slowly and not just consume the whole thing. Mm. Bye, Wench with a Wrench. Thanks for tuning in. I cooked a whole meal from scratch for the first time in my life today. That is huge. I remember the first time I started cooking by myself. That was like a lot of work. So cheers. That definitely deserves a Dr. Pepper. Put it on the side. I'm sure it'll pair with whatever you're cooking. Put it in like a nice glass over some ice. Ooh, baby. Sweet treat. Uh, I'm craving the Pepsi or Coke in my fridge. <sighs> but you should be craving a Dr. Pepper. Ah. It's better. <laughs> Have Neve paint one of the photos Smile. of her in Sky. I think I'm gonna let uh, Neve live, to be honest. Smart. Poor Neve. I, I feel bad she's like old and like probably gonna die today. And I, I keep just putting, making her stand outside uh, and, and paint. 
clever take on it. Are you playing a challenge? Yes, we're doing a short lifespan challenge right now. We're kind of doing like a rags to riches. We started from nothing here. Oh my gosh, Neve. I'm like really stressed about Neve. Uh, she keeps walking so places and I get nervous every time she goes anywhere. Go take a shower. Ooh, sing in the shower. She's, oh, she's so sad from being a widow and losing her true love. It's so sad. Oh my gosh. The challenge of the short lifespan challenge is the emotional challenge. It's the trauma. My father had his knee uh, replaced yesterday and is so far doing fantastic. I'm very happy to hear that. That is a huge win. I made progress on three scholarship essays. Dang, that's exciting. Congratulations. I'm pretty sure when I was applying to like colleges and scholarships and things like that, I just used the same essay every time. So <laughs> shout out to you. Although I guess some of them require like you do a specific prompt. So kudos, kudos. After seven years of working in a restaurant, I got a promotion to corporate payroll. That is huge. Oh my gosh, congratulations. That definitely deserves a Dr. Pepper. Where'd you get your plum bob? Um, I did not get it. It was on um, the Sorry Girls Got It. Well, if you're interested, it is linked in their video. So go watch their video on YouTube and below in the comments, there's a link to it. They made the box, um, but the plum bob itself um, is from, I think it's Etsy. Um, you should go check that out though. Oh, Neve, so sad. She's gonna be sad for the rest of her life. Very notebook of her. Honestly, she's just, oh, oh my God. I don't think she'll ever recover from losing Kyo Kyoshi, which is weird because she lived her whole life without him. Does your neon uh, sign take? No, this, the neon sign is just a neon sign. So it's always going to be purple, which is my vibe, you know, so. Uh, but everything else changes color, including the plum bob. I'm going to watch the room makeover videos after this. Yes! Svenka, thank you so much for eight months. Almost a danger baby. That's right. Uh, oh my gosh, we love to see. Oh, look at him stairs. chatting with mom. Why are you trying to cheer her up, you know? Cheer mom up. Try to cheer her up. Give her hug, hugs and compliment her outfit. Tell her she looks beautiful. And give her a big loving hug from her son, okay? Oh, that's so sweet. Just kicked my table. Oh no, I was able to... Close several no, projects of work today. Oh, that is the best Martha. feeling when you finish a project. So, so. That's how I felt today after like finally revealing all of like my office and everything. I was like, oh, the good feeling, the good stuff. Did he give her a hug like I asked him to? Oh, it's so sad. She has to go to bed alone tonight. I cannot believe she's still alive. <laughs> that sounds so mean. Oh my gosh, she's calling her. Oh, face giant. Guy's other dad just passed away. Oh no, Face Jail just passed away too. That's Sky's other dad. No, 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 no. Oh my gosh, and Knox is already dead. Wait, <laughs> did Knox die first? I didn't realize. I got tickets for the Renaissance Fair this fall. <gasps> yeah, I'm going to the Renaissance Fair too. I'm going next month. If you're in LA and you go to the Renaissance Fair and you see me, do say hi. Um, oh my gosh. All of his dads are dead. Oh no. <laughs> Pour one out. <laughs> Poor Knox. I totally forgot about him. I hope she can see the twins before she dies. Yeah, that'd be so sweet, huh? Well, Simone just popped those babies out already, okay? Wake up and, and go into labor. Come on, Simone. Come on, Simone. You got this. You got this, Simone. She needs to pee. You know? She peed herself when she woke up. Maybe that'd be her water breaking. Okay, nope. She made it to the bathroom. She's still really sad. Oh, about the de death of the, of the dog. Why don't you give yourself a little pep talk? Maybe call a... Uh, call a uh, sadness hotline. You know, you should, you should, you should be chilling. Okay, now she's feeling good. Okay, good, 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 good. She's feeling good now. I'm like, I, I want her to be happy because she's pregnant right now and she doesn't deserve it. Not Rain, thank you so much for gifting a sub. A wild Oprah appears. I'm in my final week of college classes ever and I could not be more relieved. I'm so exhausted. Oh my gosh, cheers to that. You deserve a Dr. Pepper. That is flipping huge. Congratulations. The rest of the world and the rest of your life awaits and I 
promise it's awesome. You can pretty much do the same things that you do now, but you don't have any spools. Huh. Awesome. Hang out with your friends. Fun never has to stop, right? Uh, I recently quit my job. They were taking advantage of me and I deserve better. Yes! Realizing your own worth definitely Ooh, deserves a Dr. Big. Pepper. All right, <laughs> treat yourself. Huh. Moodlet solver or journal? Oh yeah, that's true. I could I could get a little moodlet solver for my for my babies, but it looks like she's okay. She's okay right now. She's just chilling. Why don't you practice the guitar? Since I think you're maybe that like is like their shared hobby. I started exercising again recently and I'm feeling great. That's awesome! Congratulations! I think you deserve a little tasty, bubbly, delicious Dr. Pepper. <laughs> Dignity is worth more than gold. So true. Is this stream going to be longer than usual? It will be about 30 minutes longer than usual. So. I went hiking for the first time in a while and finished the hard trail beating my old time. Dang. Okay. That definitely deserves a Dr. Pepper. Look at a little chew under there. So cute. He's like, mommy, can I have a chip, please? Mom, can I have a chip? Yes, son. Yes, my son, you can have a chip. He loves chip. So, so sweet. In 18 days, I'll celebrate one year married to the most amazing and giving man a girl can ask for. Aw, congratulations. That deserves a Dr. Pepper. You guys should split one. Like one Dr. Pepper, two straws. <laughs> so cute. I took my points, but I don't have the predictor thingy. Well, we haven't predicted quite yet. It took your points and you don't have the, I see the predictor thingy on, on, on your stuff right there. Looks like you should be good. Me and my boyfriend finally found a house with a big yard for our dog. Yes! Cheers. That deserves a Dr. Pepper. A hundred percent. A hundred percent. She's just chilling. When will you have your baby? Have the baby, have the baby. Simone, Simone, look at me, look at me, look at me, look at me, Simone. Should I make her go on a run so she gets rid of the baby? Yes! Yes! You know what? I bullied her into having a baby. You guys can't see it, but it is. she's gone into labor. The notification is up there. Changing my major to what I care about instead of what my parents want. Yes! Let me say it again. Yes! You deserve a Dr. Pepper. That is huge. You know who else deserves a Dr. Pepper? It's Simone because she's having a baby. Oh my gosh. She's having a baby. She's having a baby. Bum, 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 ba, da, bum, bum, bum. Let's have the baby at the hospital. We're gonna join her. And we're gonna bring our husband with us, Sky Mason. Let's go. Come on, Sky. Wake up. We're having a baby. Get off the guitar. We're having a baby. We're having a baby. Repeat. We're having a baby. Got to go to my first concert in two years. Yes. What concert was it? Sounds good. Steph, thank you so much for seven. Oh my. I'm late to the stream because I was trying to watch the YouTube videos of your office. Ooh. Well, that's okay. That's okay. <laughs> Do we have the plan for the third gen? All will be revealed in time. I'm making all my plans shortly. No, 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 Sky. Why are you in that? All right, well. It'd be funny to ask baby's due date. Like, imagine he goes up to her and he's like, uh, what's the baby's due date? I wanted to ask that. It would be such a troll thing to do when you're in labor to walk up to your wife and go, hey, what's the baby do? <laughs> and she's like, right yeah, now, you yeah. dummy. <laughs> right now. Look, they just got a sentiment. That's absolutely hilarious to me. Okay, Simone, go have your baby. Go have your baby, Simone. I'm, I'm trolling. I'm trolling having this man talk to you right now. But he's got his little hair pulled back. He's ready to become a dad. So fun. <laughs> What's the baby do? <laughs> Get out. <laughs> Steph, thank you so much for seven months. Looks like the honors is mom while um, being a new name. Oh, wait, that reminds me. I have to name the kids. That means you guys are going to have to help me name the kids. Oh, my gosh. She's eating right now. Are you kidding me, dude? Poor Simone. She's going over here. You better come over here. You better get your butt over here. Get over here. She's having a baby. You just ran right past her. I'm, I'm like, what are you doing? Come here. Pick up your food and go over there. Hurry up! Dude, your wife is having a baby. You better be in the room with her. I will kill you. 
I will kill you stone dead. He's like, I'm so sad my dad can be here. Oh my gosh, where'd Simone go? There she is. Okay, all of my glitches are happening. And we just found out that Meredith Roswell is a nurse. Are you kidding me? Is a nurse, is an assistant nurse. An assistant nurse is, uh, is delivering our baby. What are you doing, dude? Don't. Why are you panicking right outside the room? Go inside the room. Go inside. Your wife needs you. Hold her hand. Grow up. <gasps> it's a girl. Okay. It's a girl. We need two names for the baby girls. I got a huge raise that we're going to officially out of debt. Oh my gosh. That definitely deserves a Dr. Pepper. Cheers. Treat yourself. Woohoo. Maeve. Oh, I do love Maeve. Lindsay. I mean, that makes sense. Lindsay and Lindsay too. We need to. So what are their names in the, in the movie? It's like Hallie and Annie and Hallie. We could do Annie and Hallie. All right. Let me, let me, let me, let me look at all of your guys' stuff and I'm going to manage the poll. All right. Which names for the twins? All right. So we'll have, all right, let me see. Hallie is cute. Chelsea and Kelsey, obviously the dream team. Okay. Maya. Meredith is in the movie. Lindsay and Meredith. Oh, that's true. But Meredith is not a good, a good character. I got those victory royales with my boys the other day. That deserves a Dr. Pepper. Congratulations. Get those royales. Get them. Mama and Mia. <laughs> hey, uh, Hanny and Allie. That's cute. Uh, Isabella and Iris, Tia and Tamara, Ellie, Chessie. Oh, Chessie's cute. Rose and Lily, Ellie and Kelly, Mary Kate and Ashley, like the Olsen twins. Chessie. I do like Chessie. Mila and Noella, an Indian name. We'll put, put in some Indian names. I don't know very many Indian names. Um, Lindsay and Lohan. Uh, I vote Chelsea and Kelsey. Selena and Serena. Pepper Ann. Mm, Pepper Ann is not. Ronnie. I like Ronnie. Tabitha and Tamara. April and May or May and June. Sharon and Susan. Mavis. Clarice and Reese. I'm still rooting for... Uh, I can't pronounce both of those names, unfortunately. Uh, May... I, I Unfortunately, I have a limited scope sometimes when it turns uh, comes to names, so I can't always... Pronounce all of them, and I, I do think I need to be able to pronounce the names. I I'm definitely could look them up though, but I, I'm gonna in my in my gut I want to go with something that I already can pronounce right now. Finally cleaned up my back uh, storage room. Up took me three hours. So if you have any Indian names that uh, that are a little more obvious pronunciation wise, that would be great. Oh, Maeve and Sirsha, Sirsha, Sirsha. Yeah, the Sirsha one I think will always trip me up. The Maeve I could probably get down for. Um, Maeve and Priya. I love Priya. Okay, let's I got, let's go Priya. I like Priya. Where's Priya? Where'd it go? P R I Y A. Is that right? P Pri Priya. 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 Okay, Priya and Priya and uh Krishna. I like Krishna. Priya and Krishna, Priya and, ooh, Ma Maeve. A -E. Okay, Ma Maeve and Priya, that's option number one. Okay, Pri okay. Priya and, I'm just looking at your guys' name, Ka Kara. I like Kara, Pri and Kara. That's going to be number two. And then we're going to do just like a random other one. May and... Nadia? Nadia and... So... Nadia and wait, it was Annie, Hallie and Annie. What if, if they're like, if they're, are their names with like the same, 
same like first letter, Hallie, Annie and Hallie, or like have the like the same last, like Priya and something with an A at the end. Oh, Priya and Kara actually sound like that. I might not do a vote. I might just do Priya and Kara because I think Priya and Kara sounds pretty. What about you guys? Do you think Priya and Kara sounds pretty? I bought a TV and PS4 not being able to afford insurance months ago a, in a great place now. That's awesome. <laughs> you know what? You chose yourself and it worked out. So there you have it. Yes, you like it? Okay, Priya and Kara. I like Priya and Kara because it reminds me of Holly, and, Allie and Hallie or Annie and Hallie because it, it kind of sounds similar. So yeah, we're going to go with that. All right, so first baby is called Priya. Wait, okay, that's not how you spell it. Priya. Is that correct? Priya. All right, Priya Mason. Boom, first baby. And then we have, oh, Priya and Mia. Okay, wait, that's cute too. All right, let's go. I'm gonna I'm gonna just have the second name you guys can choose. So Maeve is, is number one, Kara is number two. Mia is number three. Mia Thermopolis. That is cute. Okay. Priya and Mia. Please don't do Kara. Okay. Well, we can, we can do a vote, I guess. I like Kara, but it's fine. Priya and Mia and Leah. Leah. Okay, I'm seeing a lot of different names. Okay. Mira. M I R A. Is that how you spell it? Mira. Okay. Leah. All right. Okay, there's so many names. Okay, so got. Okay, wait. <laughs> you have so many name options. All right, here we go. This is the options that I chose. Here we go. So we got Maeve, Kara, Mia, Mira, or Leah. And you guys vote and we'll just, whatever the second name is, is the second name. There you have it. Squirrel friend, thank you so much for 24 months. Mia is, is top contender right now. Y'all are interested in Mia. Did 36 birth burpees today on purpose? <laughs> Cheers. You're flexing on all of us, literally. I did no burpees. I did not work out today. Instead, I had uh, Dr. Pepper and chips. I worked out yesterday. <laughs> but also, you don't need to work out to deserve it. But also, if you do work out, you also deserve it. Boom science. I finally started picking the guitar back up after looting motivation for ages. Cheers. Oh my gosh. You definitely deserve a Dr. Pepper. All right. It looks like Mia is a hundred percent winning. So yeah, it's going to be Priya and Mia. Mia Mason. Mia Mason is kind of cute too. That kind of sounds cute. I like it. Mia Mason. Oh my gosh. Priya and Mia are here. There we go. Priya and Mia. She is, ooh, she's dead. I got the babies. It all is happening. It is all happening. Name the twins Dr. and Pepper. Why didn't you tell me earlier I could have named the twins after Dr. Pepper? Uh, I finally told my puppy to lay down. Aw, that's perfect. I'm glad, happy for you. That definitely deserves a Dr. Pepper. Chewy. Hold on, let's get around so we get some good chewy cam action. You just reminded me. and you can see the baby oh i would like to see the baby about to finish my semester and i start my internship in london in may that is huge congratulations that definitely deserves a dr pepper in my opinion all right our babies are here we have priya and mia Ooh. actually you know what my niece is named mia in fact one of my nieces of the twin nieces by the way too i have nieces that are twins and one is named mia so shout out to my niece who my accidentally named a baby after. All right, we don't have like much room for these babies. So I guess they'll be in here for now. We're gonna have to do a home makeover, but all right, we need, oh, 
What's up? <coughs> What's up? I like Priya and Mia. They're so cute. Thank you. Okay, we're going to have like a bit of a moment. Oh my gosh. Change diaper. Look, Neve is getting to meet the babies. That's so good. She's sad, but she should be. Oh, she. Oh. She was sad about. She was like, I'm married. But she's having some family time, so she likes it. She's like a little happier with family time. Simone is having a great time. Sky is still feeling rough after witnessing the death of his father. Who can blame him? Not me. Not me. Why don't you call a little sadness hotline? Okay, buddy. All right, we need you to get tip top shape here because your children are here. Oh, poor Neve. She's also sleeping. Or she's in bed crying. Oh, it's so sad. What's the dog equivalent of Dr. Pepper? Chewie deserves one. Um, it's a Dr. Popper. <laughs> Popper. Anyway. Anyway. Oh, no, Neve. Where are you going? Play in the rain. Oh, that's so cute. Look at her. She never lost her child like wonder. Oh. And Zook Look at her. She's having a good time playing in the rain. She was stressing me out. Like, she, I keep oh. waiting for her to die. Oh. Why are you enjoying the rain in your bedroom? <laughs> ma'am? Ma'am? Oh, okay. So which twin is going to which parent? I don't know. I guess you guys will have to, like, decide, right? I don't know. Name the next dog Dr. Pepper. Dr. Pupper. Oh, that's f better, actually. Dr. Pupper <laughs> is better. Dag. It's a better joke than the one I made. Dogter Pupper. That's a pretty good one, too. Aww. Okay, so I guess I need your guys' opinion now, people. Should we disintegrate this marriage now? Should we have them move out? I mean, it just, she just gave birth. But maybe she should just get her job. Like, they call up right now. And she's like, yeah, I want to go. Priya with mom, Mia with dad. I think that does make sense. I think Sky and Mia stay together because Priya sounds like a fashiony daughter. That's true. The baby being under Sky's baby pick is adorable. Oh, yeah, that is pretty cute. That That's Priya under his baby pick. Look at those two babes. Two babes. Divorce, do it now. When they're okay, we're gonna do it now. Oh no. Okay, so she's gonna get a job. She's gonna join the career. I already know which career I want for her. Oh my gosh, this is gonna be so sad. Give her a day or two after having babies. Divorce now. Wait, should we just? Okay, should we get like a little vote here? Because it feels like some of you are disagreeing with me, and I'm like, oh, I don't know what to do. All right, so which? Uh, which should we do? Divorce now, enjoy babies for a day. It is a short lifespan though, I'm not gonna lie. And also we were thinking like, maybe it makes more sense that he'd like wanna stay because Neve wouldn't be able to move to the city either. I mean, Simone is still in her hospital gown. I mean, that's true. But a little sneak peek as to what my brain was thinking. There is a fashion, where is it, where is it, where is it, where is it? Style influencer. That's what I think I'm gonna have her be, a style influencer. Isn't that cute? He's so cute. Perfect, perfect. Or she could be an interior decorator, but I think style influencer's too cute. Ooh. Oh, it's pretty close. Divorce now or babies for a day. It is pretty close. After the mom dies, wait for Neve to die. Before they age up to Todd's. I think that they sh it should be before they age up to Todd's too, I agree. I think it should be before. Because they're babies, they don't remember their parents. They'll have to do funeral stuff anyways. She should get one day get one day of both of together. Oh, they're like, just one day! Oh, that's so funny. But all of you are like begging for one day and most of you voted divorce now. I guess we'll wait. Like, we'll wait. It's it's 11 a.m. We'll we'll have a day as the family. She's still in her hospital. Okay, okay, okay. 
I finished the crochet project I've been working on for months. Oh my gosh, that must feel so good. Big victory right there. That definitely deserves a Dr. Pepper. Cheers. <laughs> Divorce will wait to leave until after Neve's death. I don't know if that makes sense as much because I feel like she would leave. I don't think they'd divorce and stay in the same place. I feel like they would they would be like kind of like bickering. Maybe they'll bicker a little bit. Just like a little just a little bickering. You know, just like a, a hint of bickering. I think she'll start it. A little bit. Just like a little uh maybe argue about parenting. Ooh, she's going into the baby room. The baby is upset. All right, so she's gonna change the dirty diaper and then maybe they'll argue a little bit about parenting. You know? I bet she'll be like, I kind of want to move them closer to my dad, you know, like. And he'll be like, well, Neve is, you know, getting on an age, I can't leave. Yeah, I think they're gonna argue a little bit. So we'll, we'll, we'll build it up, we'll build it up. We'll not just go from zero to 60, okay? They're having a little bit of an argument. And he's like, no, I can't move them away from here. They're going to have a perfect childhood here. And she's like, they did not discuss where they were going to live once they had babies. Uh-oh. Trouble in paradise. And Neve is walking in on them, but arguing. I love that it's still a suggestive conversation. Like, what's that about? I was able to see a great photo of all my brother's kids after my nephew's birth. That's so cute. I love that. Maybe how he joked Boy, and abandoned her while in labor. Bad. Oh, that's Both also true. Rad. I think they should argue about that. Oh, well, Vina. He is. Ah. Give him the cold shoulder a little bit after that argument. Kind of ice him out. I feel like that might be Simone's kind of thing is just like icing him out, you know? Be like, whatever. Huh. <laughs> I'm not going to talk to you about this. Like, agree to disagree. And then why don't you just like have a bit of time? Oh, why don't you go rock the baby? Kind of like peace out. Neve is so depressed. She's so devastated. The poor baby. She's like trying. She's trying for her ki her kids though. You know, she's trying for the kids. She's like, no, Neve, I've got it. Uh, and then Neve Neve took, took care of the baby before Simone could do it. Simone's probably like, you know what? I'm gonna take a nap. I'm gonna take a nap. You know what? I'm gonna take a nap. Goodbye. They're trying to get back on to good terms. They are mostly on good terms. They're still flirty with each other. <laughs> Neve is trying to mediate. Yeah, that's true. She's like, why don't we all listen to a good little guitar tune? <laughs> Finally got a job after seven months of being unemployed. That is huge. That definitely deserves a Dr. Pepper. Cheers. Paint the babies before she passes. I think I'm not going to do any more paintings. Plus the babies in The Sims always all look the same. So she already has a, a big photo of a baby. I don't know if we need more. Look how many like paintings we have. Like we just have too many, I think. <laughs> so, will they get back together when the girls or kids, preteens in the movies? Yes, when they're, I think when they're kids or preteens, they'll get back together. Uh, made a princess dress cake from all the scratch, uh, scratch this week. Fondant to filling from all scratch. Wow. That is impressive. That definitely deserves a Dr. Pepper. Oh my gosh, my dog just blended into this. You can't even see where his head is. He is fully blended into that. <laughs> Never too many paintings and pictures. That's your prerogative. My prerogative is letting Neve live her life and not forcing her to go outside and paint in the rain, okay? We're not doing it. I started college at 32 and I'm doing awesome. Yes. Oh my gosh. I cannot imagine going back to college. So shout out to you. That is huge. Getting it. Furthering that education. Oh, Absolutely oh. exciting. That is so good. So, so good. One second. We're having a final call on nominations. They will be randomly chosen in about five minutes. So make sure, as a reminder, the winners will have to be 18 and over and US based. If you win, um, uh, Tanya will whisper you on Twitch to collect your info and confirm their age in US, your age in US residency in order for you to win. So I'll keep an eye out whoop, for that. 
Uh, but make sure to keep uh, posting your wins and you might win um, a awesome prize from Dr. Pepper. Uh, three runner ups will win a $50 Twitch gift card each. And uh, the grand prize winner will receive 50 cases of Dr. Pepper to make a Dr. Pepper throne. Uh, and please, 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 if you win the Dr. Pepper throne, send me a photo of yourself on the throne. I really want to see that. I would like to see it. <laughs> Um, got introduced and in inducted to an honor society for my 3.96 GPA for nuclear medicine. We are unworthy of your brilliance. Cheers. I switched, I switched drinks on you. Bam. Switch drinks on you. <laughs> you didn't expect that. I finished four out of five of my university finals. Yes. Cheers. A soda throne. Yes. A Dr. Pepper throne. Shoot. In fact, oh, they're making up. I don't want to break them up. I don't want to break them up. <gasps> she pulled out Neve's guitar. Oh, look at the divorce. Oh, no. Oh, argue about her career. That's a good one to argue about. Poor Neve. I think that she's going to keep that guitar as a gift from me or from. Oh, no, Prius. He... Okay, she's fine. Oh, my. Why don't you go feed the baby, Neve? No. Neve is trying to mediate. She's like, don't worry, I'll, I'll feed the baby while they're fighting. Oh no, it's so sad. That was a wolf figured out kiss. I know it's so sad. It's so sad. Them like in there and he's like arguing. He's like, no, you can't go away for a job. She's like, it's literally my dream. I've been dreaming of this my whole life. If I get an offer, we should go. He doesn't even have a job here. So I don't know what his deal is. <gasps> this woman is saying a social media career. No, he doesn't want it. He also probably doesn't like social media that much. So he probably is like not as into it. She's like, this is my dream, dude. North. Also, I kind of want to change her outfit. Maybe we'll put on like her cozy clothes. Yeah, her cozy clothes are cute. Just Dude, her cozy clothes. They're so arguing. I love that this, this is a suggestive conversation still. They are into fighting, apparently. Working for a regular company while trying to start my own business while running my family. Dang. Okay, you definitely deserve. You deserve three Dr. Peppers for that. Oh my gosh. People do always want to work with him. They find him very impressive. All right, she's getting. Oh, Neve is already on the case. She's like, "Don't worry, I'm gonna." Oh, and she even changed the do the baby. Oh, they're still fighting. Oh my gosh. All right, why don't you fight with him? Give him the cold shoulder again. Be like, I don't want to talk about this. Oops. Oh my god, that looks like a divorce right there. That looks like a divorce button right there. I'm not gonna lie. She's gonna go rock Mia. There we go. Now she's flirting with him again. <laughs> so <laughs> awkward. It is now an unpleasant conversation. <laughs> she's flirting with him again. They they are not on the same page with things. He's like, I'm gonna I'm gonna rock Mia. I'm taking care of Mia. Although I kinda want her to spend a lot of time with Mia. Since like they're not gonna see each other for so long. It's so weird. The stress of parenting is real. I feel that, yeah. Like this is totally normal to have these kind of stressors and things. But the thing, is, yeah, it's definitely a you're, you're cute when you're angry energy between them, for sure. You know, she is technically based off of uh, Kate from Bridgerton. So <laughs> that makes a lot of sense that they like, a, she likes them feisty. Uh, but I do think like at the end, like this part, they can all handle and weather those storms of the fights, but they can't weather the storm of her actually getting up and moving. Moved into a new townhouse with my best friend and cat. It's the first place I've lived that's felt like home. Oh, congratulations. That definitely deserves a Dr. Pepper, baby. Yes. Cheers. Boom. <gasps> the winners are here, guys. Okay, I'm gonna pause this um, and save here. Also, my alarm just went off. Uh, for something else. Okay. 